This video tutorial is about fruit and seed formation. When a pollen grain lands on the stigma of a flower of the correct species, a pollen tube begins to grow. The pollen tube grows through the style until it reaches an ovule inside the ovary. The nucleus of the pollen then passes along the pollen tube and fuses with the nucleus of the ovule. This process is called fertilization. After fertilization, the ovules become seeds and the rest of the carpal, the female part of the plant, becomes the fruit. A seed has three main parts, the embryo, the food store and the seed coat. The embryo is the young root and shoot that will become the adult plant. So it contains the earliest forms of the plant's roots, leaves and stems and is capable of sensing when the conditions are correct for growth to take place. The food store contains the starch for the young plant to use until it is able to carry out photosynthesis. Storing the food helps the plant to use it in winter and survive because there is little sunshine or little sunlight available and so there is less possibility for photosynthesis. The food store is there and so the seed is able to use it until it can photosynthesize and produce its own food. The seed coat is a tough protective outer covering. It protects the embryo against adverse environmental conditions. To do this, it controls germination through dormancy in position and by limiting the detrimental activity of physical and biological agents.